Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Artesia and if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. In today's video, I will talk about New Year's resolution for 2021 and I will share you some of the healthy and fitness related New Year resolution for you to pick from for this 2021 upcoming year. So New Year's resolution, oh well, how many we have done, we have promised ourselves to, lot. So let's start by saying that a new year often signifies a fresh start for many people. For some, maybe this means setting a healthy goal, such as losing weight, following a healthy diet and starting an exercise routine. However, more often than not, the health and fitness resolution chosen are highly restrictive and unsustainable, leading most people to break the resolution within a few weeks. So this is why many people make the same resolution year after year and promise themselves to do it next year, next Monday, you know. So to break the cycle, it's really important to make a resolution that, that can not only improve health, but also be followed for life. So here are 50 New Year's resolutions you can actually keep. Let's start with number one. Eat more whole foods. So one of the healthiest and most sustainable way to improve your health is to eat more whole food. Whole food including vegetables, fruits, nuts, grain, seeds, tofu, they all contain, contain nutrients that your body will need to function at optimal health. So research showed that following a whole food based diet might significantly reduce heart disease and like body weight uh, related factor, blood sugar levels, as well as decrease your risk of certain type of diabetes and cancer. So what's more like easy to add in more whole food to your diet by maybe by sprinkling some seed in your salad or just introduce more vegetable in your diet maybe twice per week eating more vegetable with your main meal and you know things like this that you can implement easier in your diet so just try it so number two get more quality sleep sleep is essential part of overall health a sleep deprivation can lead to serious consequences believe me for instance, lack of sleep might increase your risk of weight gain, yes it does, heart disease and depression. Of course, there's many reasons why people don't get enough sleep and so it's important to focus on your schedule and lifestyle to determine the best way that you can improve your quality of sleep. Maybe, you know, change something in your routine and make that work around it. So for example, decrease screen time before bed that will massively help you, reduce light pollution in your bedroom, cutting back on caffeine before bed and getting to a bed at reasonable hours and you know like simple ways to improve this sleep that the sleep pattern that can really help you to change your sleep quality. So number three, take more me time and practice self-care. I cannot stress that enough. Taking time for yourself is not selfish. It is not. Stop it. In fact, it's imperative for optimal health and well-being. This is especially true for those in uh, caretakers' roles, such as like parenting, healthcare workers, so, so, so important. For people with busy schedules and limited time, make a resolution to engage in self-care and maybe take, yeah, some planning, but it can work. So, however, it's well worth the time to invest because it's you, you invest in yourself. So self-care doesn't have to be elaborate or time-consuming. It can be simple things. So it can be maybe taking a bath every week, attending your favorite week yoga class, preparing an healthy meal for yourself, go at, at the gym one hour, maybe three times per week, or getting an extra hour of sleep, or just have a walk in nature. Really important. So simple way that you can incorporate that in your lifestyle. Number four. 
spend more time outside. Oh, this one as well, I cannot stress that enough. So spending more time outdoor can improve health, relieving stress, elevating mood, believe me, and even lowering blood pressure. Yes, it does. So making a New Year's resolution to spend more time outside every day is a really sustainable way uh, to achieve this health goal that you can set to yourself and that can benefit everyone no matter where you live. So taking a walk outside during your lunch break, maybe hiking on the weekend, going camping with your friend, so maybe just on your back garden or local park and just way to incorporate this nature in your daily routine because it's so important, nature is everything. Yes. All right, let's stop. So number five, cut back on alcohol. Through alcohol can certainly fit into an healthy diet. I'm not saying no, but it's too often can be ne negative on your health. So what's more drinking alcohol frequently might keep you from reaching your health and wellness goal. Believe me, it does. So if you think cutting back on alcohol might be helpful for you, set a reasonable goal for you to keep on track, such maybe limiting the drinking to just weekend nights and not just in the weekday. Um, maybe setting like a drink limit that can help as well for the week so you know where you at. So if you need a non-alcoholic beverage, idea to replace maybe your usual you know cocktail of your choice try maybe fruit infused um or maybe mocktail that can help you know to just switch to from alcoholic to non alcoholic option that can just be implemented like i said easy during the week so let's go number six be kinder oh yes what could be more kind of the seven animals Yes, of course I'm vegan, so I will tell you that this year giving up animal flesh and other animal derived food a switch to a compassionate plant-based diet, it can be your really great New Year's revolution, so veganery. So the non-profit organization One Agri is the trying to get more and more people to switch for like plant-based option to help fight the climate crisis and animal cruelty. So why not try this year, you know, to swap, to swap your habits and just, you know, introduce a plant-based option that can maybe result from a New Year's resolution to a life-changing choice. I really hope so. So number seven, stop negative body talk. Talking negatively about your, about your body can lead to feelings of body shame. In fact, research showed that Engaging in like even negative body talk is associated with higher level of body uh, dissatisfaction and decreased self-esteem in both women and men. Yes, even men suffer from that. So make an healthy New Year's resolution to engage in positive self-talk regularly and like reduce negative body talk. This improve your relationship with your own body, but also encourage others to stop talking negative about themselves because nowadays oh, there's so much of this bad talk. So let's focus on positivity, right? Let's do this. Number eight, limit screen time. Many people depend on their phone, computer, we know, for work, entertainment. However, spending too much time on electronic devices particularly on social media, yes, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, <laughs> has been linked to depression, anxiety, and loneliness in some study because, let's face it, we usually compare ourselves to everyone out there, yes? Yeah. So setting a resolution and to spending less time through the social media, you know, playing computer games and all this stuff can really help boost your mood and it change productivity. It does. Yes, we just need to talk about it and make sure we make these changes. Number nine, find the physical activity that you enjoy. So every year, people will chase expensive membership to gym, workout studio, online fitness program, enough that you shred in the excess body fat in the here to come, we know. <laughs> For most people start strong in the beginning of the year and then the majority don't make it a routine into the lasting, like it into a lasting habit. 
So choose an activity based on your enjoyment, what you like to do. You don't need to go to the gym, lift weight. You don't need to go and buy. Choose wherever you like. So for example, taking an half an hour walk, jog or bike ride before work, swimming, um, go to the gym with a friend, you know, just try. Try whatever you think you might like and then swap. So make a sustainable exercise resolution because just for health, right? We know. <laughs> so then set like an attendable goal, such as planning to work for a few specific days, maybe with friends, with your partner, instead of aiming to do that every day. So don't rush into it, make like a planning uh, to switch by each week. So making a more realistic goal can really change the changes of making your new routine last especially if you're new to working out, wherever it is that you're gonna do, okay? It doesn't matter if you're just walking. So number 10, and yes, it is stop dieting. Why? So chronic dieting is harmful to both physical and mental health. Plus, more people will lose weight through the restrictive dieting, ending up again to pull the weight back on within maybe one year of when they lost it. So dieting can also make it harder to lose weight in the future. Mm. Yes, so true. So rather than setting a new year resolution to lose weight by using restrictive measures, such as fat diet, there's so many out there, you know, try an healthier, more sustainable method of weight loss by focusing on increasing physical activities of, you know, expenditure and eating healthier food. So why not try one of my New Year Body Transformation package program that I just released? So you can choose from six week transformation program so you can choose from six weeks transformation program, eight week transformation program, and 12 week transformation program. And they're all sustainable. They're not gonna be restricted diet, excessive exercise. No, everything's gonna be amazingly shaped for you to work. So each package includes two online PT sessions per week. Yes, with myself. The nutrition plan for you to choose from, vegan, vegetarian, omnivore, and nutrition catalog for you to understand everything about food. You will have a recipe package, 24 7 support by email, WhatsApp, text, and before and after transformation picture. So what are you waiting for? Inbox me, I will put an email address here below and I will be more than happy to start this amazing journey with you. And amazing because we can change your health, your mood, everything will be better. Inbox me. So if you like this video, click the like button, comment below, let me know your thoughts, some questions that you've that you maybe have and let me know if you're gonna choose one of these new year's resolution for you and this upcoming year so don't forget to subscribe here finally i'd like to leave you with one of my last thoughts from motivational speaker jim Rohn that summarized that my main idea of what i want to talk about today so take care of your body is the only place you have to live it's so true isn't it yes so have an happy and healthy new year and i hope to see you soon on my channel you take care of yourself and let's go for this amazing exciting here bye